This is our second example for homogeneous differential equation. So solve for the following differential equation, 2x plus y dx minus x dy equal to 0. Okay, so muna itong given class. Wait lang. Okay. Then check na to if variable separable ba siya class. So by mata-mata, makita na to na this is not a variable separable equation. So ang next na to bahatan is atong i-ask atong self if homogeneous equation ba siya. So, to answer this question, kailangan pa na to siya i-check. So, how do we check it? So, we let x equal to vx and y equal to vy. So, kani silang x and y na to class. Mo nitong ipang butang, diri as itong original equation. So, you have um, 2, wait lang ha, penta. So, x equals to vx, y equal to vy, x equal to vx. Okay? So, i-butang lang yun na to siya class. Then, uh, this is common, this is common, so gigawas siya diri ah, ko alang. Then, kani class and kani class, they are common sa both terms, so gifactor out po dato siya diri ah class, ko alang. So, makita na to, na kani siyang diri ah sa sulod, is exactly equal sa diri ah sa atong original equation. So, if kani siya, is nibalik lang kani kani, kani kani class, Kana siya is nibalik lang siya sa itong original equation. Then, therefore, we can say na yes, homogeneous equation siya. Okay, so after na verify na to na okay, homogeneous equation good siya. Then, let's start solving na class. So, how do we solve it? So, we let x equal to vy, dx equal to v dy plus y dv. Or, okay, or y equal to vx, dy equal to v dx plus x dv. Question is, which is which? Tama? So, in this problem class, we will choose kani, y equal to kani, class, kani day rather, y equal to vx and dy equal to vdx plus x dv because dy has the least number of terms. Kung tanawan ninyo class, dy has the least number of terms. So, ang dx is 1, 2. So, ang least number of terms itong basihan. So, since dy, least number of terms. So, kani itong gamiton. Ang y equal to vx and dy equal to vdx plus x dv. Okay? So, okay na. Kani siya. Gikan lang niya ako. Digo lang nato ni siya class. So, mo na itong original equation. So, kani siya class. Pasalak sa to ang given equation sa problem. So, we have 2x. And, di ba, y equal to vx. Tama. Tapos, x. Then, imong dy is equal to vdx plus x dv. So, mo na na siya class. Okay, then, simplify na to class. You have 2x dx. Tana siya. Then, you have kani class kay vx dx. Then, x v dx or that's equal to vx dx gihapon. Simplify lang na to, ha. Tapos, you have x times diri a class. So, you have negative x squared dv. Negative, ha. Kay nakaparentesis ni siya. So, na-distribute parang negative sign. Okay. So, na-simplify na. And then, ma-realize na to class na kani siya is ma-cancel. So, if na kay na-cancel, then that's a good sign na marag patulungan ito sa tama na answer. So, ang mabilin is 2x dx minus x squared dv equal to 0. So, ma-simplify na to siya such that mahimo siyang 2x over x squared dx minus dv. Tama? So, in this case, um, cancel ni, cancel ni. So, nahimo siyang 2 over x dx. This is a variable separable equation already. Familiar? Okay, nga naman, ang imuhang x na grupo ni mo kay dx. And then, of course, si dv lang. That class, wait lang. Okay. So, once nga na variable separable na nato siya class, so na-separate na to mga variables na to, diba? Once na sa variable separable na siya, you can proceed now with integration. So, you have the integral of 2 over x dx minus the integral of dv. So, next slide ta. So, mo na itong i-integrate. Take note class na integral of 1 over x dx is equal to ln of x plus c. Diba? This is simply uh, 2 integral of 1 over x dx. Gawas lang ni mo ang 2 which is constant. So, minus integral dv equal to 0. Tama? Gawas lang ang 2 kay constant na siya. So, this is integral of 1 over x. So, integral of 1 over x is equal to ln of x plus c. So, kaning imong integral of dv that's equal to v plus c. Okay? So, ang naa sa 2A class is, ang integral ane is equal to this, 2LNX plus C. And ang integral sa imuhang DV is equal to ane class. 
Okay, then, gisimplify lang nato siya. We're in, kaning ito ang plus C and kaning C. Gihalo lang nato siya together. Diba? Kaya maski pag magkinaon sa, that's a constant plus another constant or a constant minus a constant is still a constant. Tama? So, you have 2 ln of x minus b plus the constant equal to 0. Okay? Then, take note that, diba, ganina nag-substitute na to wherein y equal to bx. Remember? So, we can say v is equal to y over x. Tama? Gi-rearrange lang niya. So, kaning v na to na nakuha diri ah, na y equal to I'm sorry, na v is equal to y over x, butang dahin diri ah. So, you have 2 ln of x minus y over x plus c. Pero wala patanong man class, isimplify sana to siya further ha. So, multiply both sides by x. So, naan na kay 2 ln of x minus y plus x c is equal to 0. So, question is, ma'am, nga numang, nga nung x c man na siya, di ba? Ano ka, anything times the constant is a constant. So, Kato siya akong ginaingon, a constant times a constant is a constant. Pero in this case, a variable times the constant is variable times constant. But anyway, this is, x is not a constant, di ba? It's a variable. So, dili ka mo ingon nga, kani siya, mahimong C, dayon siya. Kay C lang na siya, class, if atong gimultiply ani niya, is a constant. Pero in this case, it's a variable times a constant man. So, dapat, x, C, gani mo ibutang, dili lang siya C. Okay, so, I hope nag-make sense to siya. Okay, then, simplify pag it further. Oops, natabunan. So, wait, erase na to ang mga salat. Okay, so, simplify na to ni siya class wherein kaning y, gitranspose sa picat side. So, we have 2x ln of x plus x c equal to y. Okay, then, kani, and kani, gifactor out lang na to siya class. So, you have, Inana na siya kalas. So, x times the, the quantity to ln of x plus c is equal to y. So, that is your final answer. Okay? So, again, ang proper solution sa homogeneous differential equation is medyo taas siya. Tapos, napag factor na basig, delete ni mo siya ma-integrate. Kaya basig lusod dahil siya integrate So, uh, I suggest kapag differential equation class sa board exam, I suggest nga uh, do proper solution. I don't, don't know, no. Do calculator technique po, if makaya ni mo. Eh, although, kaya mo ginang calculator technique. So, ang akong point lang is, atong gibuhat mang good na solution karon is very, kanang, lengthy, taas ba? So, I, I think, mas better if mag-calculator technique ka. Tapos, habang, do, kablo ko, dugay mong good magawas ang answer sa calculator technique. So, I think, pwede ka mo calculator technique, and on the other side, and while nag-calculator technique ka, nag-proper solution po ka. So, Pwede na good inana siya, yung button. So, anyway, um, sa next video is, kanina problem, solve na to siya sa calculator technique. Though, I think, kabalo naman siguro at tanan, if, if itanaon ninyo ang mga past videos about calculator technique, ay, uh, same process ng gihapon. Pero, sige lang, next video ta class for the calculator technique.